Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther, and today we're going to check it out how to make this shell in Photoshop, shall we? First step, let's select the circle. I'm going to long click on the rectangle, select the ellipse tool, press and hold shift, create a circle. And we're going to go up here to the path operation and select the exclude overlapping shapes. Now from here, I'm going to press control alt plus T to activate the transform control panel here. And make sure to check this little box, which is the toggle reference point. Basically, this is the reference point, this anchor point, and you, you just need to drag and drop it here up to the upper right corner. You can also do this clicking on this little thing right here. As you can see, it transformed black. I'm going to press and hold shift from here and rotate it minus 15 degrees to the right. And check this out. Basically, it created two circles and it excluded the center point of the overlapping circles. From here, we're gonna activate the maintain aspect ratio, this little lock here, and we're gonna decrease the percentage to 93, so it's gonna be smaller. Now I'm gonna double click on the circle to release it, and I'm gonna press Control Alt plus Shift plus T. And this way it's gonna, I'm gonna press the letter T until it goes round and round like this. We can also resize this pretty easily. I'm gonna press Control T, Press and hold shift plus alt, scale it up. By the way, this is a vector shape. You can scale it up however you like. And if you go to the layers, as you can see, it's just one single layer in here. Also, if you want to check it out how to create this impossible shape in Adobe Illustrator, you can join the members only channel and watch more premium tutorials and learn more stuff. And mainly this is it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Oh,